following six-man contest is a battle royale. Making his way to the ring from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, the WWE Champion, the Phenomenal AJ Styles. Ladies and gentlemen, anytime AJ Styles makes his way to the ring, there's a good chance we might just see an instant classic. And I suspect we'll see more of the same here tonight. Pure excellence. And Byron, I'd say he appears to be at the top of his game right now. Well, he's going to need to be if he wants to survive this match. That's for sure. And his opponents, first, from West Newberry, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, John Cena! John Cena is here. And it sounds to me like he's being showered with just as many boos as he is cheers. I gotta say, guys, he doesn't appear to be in the mood here tonight. He's not the only one, Cole. I gotta say, I'm not really in the mood to be sitting next to you two. But hey, we do what we have to do. From Death Valley, weighing in at 328 pounds, The Undertaker! And a chill has come over this arena as the dead man makes his way to the ring. You're not kidding, Cole. There's a literal chill that just came over us. It's unbelievable. Though I'd say he definitely has his work cut out for him here tonight. Yeah, this one's not going to be easy, that's for sure. But hey, is anything worth doing ever easy? Weighing in at 326 pounds, Kane! Uh-oh, here comes seven feet of pure destruction. 
through hellfire and brimstone, as our good friend JR would say. And let's not forget about his opposition, who also comes into tonight looking to prove a point. Well, I should hope so, Cole. If you don't go into every single match looking to make a statement, then you're just wasting everybody's time. From Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, the WWE Universal Champion, Brock Lesnar. If this one lives up to the hype, Byron, we're in for an amazing match here tonight. There's no reason to think this one won't live up to the hype, Michael. We're looking at some of the most intense competitors in all of WWE. And a win here would go a long way in proving he's as good as he says he is. Sounds like you're doubting him, Cole. Let me tell you something. You never want to doubt this guy. Trust me. From Tampa, Florida, weighing in at 500 pounds, The Big Show! A big time battle royal here, guys. Who do you like in this one, Byron? Well, historically, you're safest when you put your money on the biggest superstar. But to be honest, I'm not sure. I can see any one of these competitors walking away with a win. Well, to say he looks ready to get this match started would certainly be understating his eagerness right now. Yeah, the opening bell can't come soon enough for him, Cole. And I must say, I absolutely love seeing so much enthusiasm from him. And there's bodies everywhere as we get this battle royal started. This is one this Kansas crowd came to see, guys. Here we go. That might have hurt his head just as much. Oh, that was a hard shot. What a strike. And the strike lands. John Cena with the offense. Tell us about AJ Styles. How do you see him getting it done here tonight? Now, this is what I like. Nothing compares to members of the WWE locker room getting in there and letting fists fly. And remember, only one can be victorious. It'll require tremendous effort on his part to not suffer permanent physical or mental damage after this one's over. Great offense by John Cena. And a powerful forearm. If there's a finishing move that can end an opponent's existence once and for all, it's the F5 from the Beast Incarnate. The move shows Lesnar's power and true disdain for humanity. Clearly not concerned with his own well-being there. AJ Styles beginning to look a little weak out here. He needs to find a way to get on the offensive, guys. He was one of my favorites heading into this battle royal, and I'm not ready to write him off the list just yet. He's got plenty of fight left in him. Yeah, he's clearly not on the right side of this match right now, which is 
A little surprising to me. Now we have Kane on the attack. Definitely not where you want to be right now. He's got to find a way to get out of this, Michael. He lands the overhand. The Undertaker got him there. The great ones always explode when they have the chance. He gets him with the overhand punch. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh God, that was hitting the nail right on the head. If he takes many more of those, he's gonna get lit up like a Christmas tree. He lands the strike with great accuracy. You can't put a price tag on landing that perfect strike. And that nailed him. This is a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. But if anybody could break free from this, it's this superstar right here. Brock Lesnar with a nice reversal. His clothesline finds the mark. He's always had great stamina. See if it lasts here. Choke slam! He's in the driver's seat now. Let me tell you, the human body was not meant to be slammed like that. Guys, when you have as trained an eye as I do, you get to a point where you can see the finisher coming before it actually comes. And let me tip you off to something here. It's coming, and it's coming very soon. There's the suplex. Brock Lesnar going to work now. Saxton, I like you. I want to take you on an all-expenses paid vacation to Suplex City. Oh, no, I'll pass. The Undertaker is not Suplex City. He needs to capitalize on it now. He's got a head of steam. See how long he can sustain it. Undertaker starting to look human here. You can bet this is not how he drew this one up. He's absorbed a lot of punishment so far, guys, but getting him over the ropes into the arena floor will be no easy task. I can assure you of that. He's looked great up until now, and it's imperative that he doesn't lose focus and let his opponent back into this match. Big Show got him there. Oh, the reversal by Brock Lesnar. Lesnar starting to teeter. This match is definitely testing his metal, guys. With so much mass in the ring at the same time, bodies have a way of getting beaten and broken, and that's exactly what's happening to him right now. Yeah, but the good news is that she still appears to be in better condition than his opposition right now. He has him right where he wants him. Oh, no. Lesnar's about to end this with an F5. Bang! Here's his moment, Michael. Let's check this out again, Corey. So effective, Cole. When this guy's on, look out. And Byron, this takes a ton of strength to pull off, am I right? Oh, you are definitely right, Michael. But you also have to remember how much energy it drains to pull off. Big Show got him there. Big Show shows us some clever offense here. John Cena with a nice reversal. Ain't no stopping him now. Brock Lesnar with a nice reversal. Things have gone from bad to worse for The Undertaker. And I'm not sure he even knows where he is. This has got to be incredibly disappointing for him, guys. Remember, he's already executed two finishers here tonight, and neither served their purpose. And now, it looks like he's at the end of his rope. Let's remember, though, guys, his opponent doesn't seem to be in great shape either. There it is, the attitude adjustment. Are we looking at yet another John Cena victory here? But can John Cena capitalize? Look 
of this. Still trying to get back to his feet here. He's clearly in a bad way right now. You'd have to think hitting the finisher here could end this thing. Going to be tough for him to fight back from this. Well, the first thing he needs to do is get back to his feet, which is clearly easier said than done. We're witnessing a level of punishment that can only be described as, that's it, the final elimination. This one's over. Let's not overcomplicate things. This business is simple. It's all about wins and losses. And it sure looks to me like somebody has figured that out. Thank you for tuning in tonight, folks. We hope you enjoyed that great match.